and welcome to TRC Talks. I'm Casey Novak, Marketing Director for TRC Digital and your host for this episode. Investing in new or upgraded utility infrastructure is a major commitment and challenge, and access to accurate system models is critical to moving projects forward successfully. Yet many utilities struggle with navigating through the data needed to make decisions. TRC recently launched LineHub, a new solution transforming transmission engineering through digital data management and an enterprise-wide view of the grid. To educate us on LineHub, I have with me two industry experts, Ryan Bliss, Vice President of TRC's Transmission Engineering Practice, and Rob Sutherland, TRC's Director of Engineering for Digital Grid Solutions. So let's start with the basics. Ryan, at its core, what is LineHub and what does it do? LineHub is a disruptive technology. It, it really changes the way the work is done today. Um, our, at, at its core, it's, it's a data management as well as a workflow management solution that, is, that functions at the enterprise level. So it really has the the ability to dramatically increase efficiencies and productivities of, uh, of engineering teams, as well as protect data and, and bring uh, compliance to, to, uh, to cybersecurity and, and data management uh, protocols. So kind of related to that, um, who within a utility would be most interested in LineHub and why? Yeah, so there's there's really multiple stakeholders, but the the primary three, the the the, the largest would be the engineering uh, team. The engineering team, this is their day in and day out process, and so they would greatly benefit from having a an enterprise data management solution that helps them uh, and keeps them on a consistent workflow across their project as well as managing their data. Uh, the second would be asset management, uh, or really anybody that's from an executive to, uh, you know, compliance to risk management. Any of those types of functions could gain information and 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 better make better decisions based on the information that they could pull out of out of LineHub. And then the third would be the the IT group. The IT has a lot of. Uh, uh, policies and protocols in managing data. This helps them have a greater control and access to, to managing that data and keeping it secure. Okay, and Rob, to get you in the conversation, can you tell us about what makes LineHub unique from a technology perspective? Yeah, sure. Um, yeah, as Ryan mentioned, we're trying to, trying to take this um, you know, really powerful desktop tool and, and, and bring it to the enterprise. So um, in doing so, we chose, you know, some chose technologies to support, um, you know, some kind of key functions in there. So one is uh, configurability. Uh, we picked a technology to allow the utility to then um, build those workflows and processes and automations in a UI. So it doesn't require a developer to do it. It's something that business users can do to then build out and support those different processes at the utility. Um, the other kind of one of the other really main drivers is this, this ability to visualize data. So uh, taking that desktop engineering data, unlocking it, pulling it together with all the other models. So you can see your whole um, territory, you know, the data holistically. So asset managers, folks at the utility that never even had access to that data before can now understand it, see it, gain value from it, and we can then report on it kind of across the enterprise. Um, data security is obviously another decision, uh, key kind of uh, area where we, we made technology decisions on to make sure we're maintaining integrity, we're storing things safely. Um, we know who is accessing files, who's making changes to the files, what those changes are and why, um, which is really important, something that you don't have uh, today necessarily. And then you know, lastly, I think the um, ease of integration. So taking not only this, this engineering data, but bringing it together with GIS data, enterprise asset management data, validating all that data together, presenting it to the user and making sure that the user has kind of a single source of truth as they, as they move throughout their workflow. And so when we talk about LineHub's tagline, 
Transforming Utility Engineering Through Digital Data Management. What does that mean to each of you? For me, it, it really means this is, you know, if you look at other industries, if you look at other practices, um, you know, say accounting, you know, utilities and, you know, every, you know, the whole world has digitized that process a long time ago. So being able to approve an invoice, to review and approve an invoice, um, you know, digitally, you know, in, in, a, in a system or a solution, you know, we've, we've all become accustomed to doing that. And the reason they did that is because there's value in the efficiencies gained by pushing that to be digital. We're looking, and this solution is, is gonna basically do the same thing, but for engineering involving uh, PLS CAD files. But the process right now, today, across the world is very analog. You know, we, we prepare documents, and we email them, or we submit them into a, a, a website. And whoever on the other end, they download them, they print them out. Uh, the process is not being managed by a database. There's, there's tremendous efficiencies that, we'll, that we expect to, to release and the value that comes from those by just having a managed workflow system. You know, you have a consistent process, you have consistent deliverables, you have you know, you get really good metrics on performance and, uh, you know, uh, results. To me, the technology is obviously interesting, but it's about how we use that technology to really deliver that transformation. So it's, you know, helping the engineers, the transmission engineers improve, um, you know, how they do the work, making them more efficient, giving them better tools and data to do their jobs and do it, do it well. Uh, it's about helping the asset managers better understand the assets out in the field and the risks associated with those so that they can make the decisions around that um, more quickly. And, you know, I think this, you know, ultimately drives a safer, um, more reliable, more cost-effective uh, operations of the transmission system. Well, this has been a great discussion, guys. Thank you both for your insights. And thank you, viewers, for joining TRC Talks.